every football fan looks forward to. A lot on the line and the likelihood of a tension-packed occasion. It's Inter, they face Juventus, and it's live next on EA TV. A big night at one of the most famous venues in world football. We're here at the San Siro. I'm Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry, and alongside me at the microphone is Stuart Robson. I'm greatly looking forward to bringing you live coverage of this match being played in Serie A. It's Inter up against Juventus. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield will be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. The Inter starting lineup. Milan Skriniar plays alongside Alessandro Bastoni in central defence. Nicolo Barella plays with Henrik Mkhitaryan in the centre of midfield. And in attack, Edin Dzeko starts alongside Lautaro Martinez. And this is how Juventus will line up. Wojciech Szczesny between the posts. Paul Pogba plays alongside Adi Arabio in the centre of the park. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. A game that should have plenty to say for itself. Juventus kick off. Nice switch of play. Locatelli. And good use of advantage. The referee allowing play to continue. Well, letting it continue to see if, in fact, there was an advantage, but not so. Free kick. Martinez. And this might not be the ideal situation for them. And they've bought themselves a bit of time. Mkhitaryan! And a goal! An early boost for them. The first goal of the game. They're off and running. Well, here it is again. And the defending simply isn't good enough. They have to react quicker, deal with the danger and show more urgency. None of which they did, and that's the result. And back playing here with Inter, the team holding the advantage. Di Maria. Di Maria fine cross into the middle a very effective clearance being pressed hard Dzeko Barella determined defending Kostic Vraovic and unable to keep the ball
Locatelli. This could level it. And he thought of the attack with a masterful tackle. Matteo Damian. Space on the flank. So a throw in for Inter here. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Locatelli. Di Maria now. Well, that's a really good authoritative tackle. Throw in here. Well, when you sit off like this, you invite pressure. Skriniar. Read it superbly to take back possession. He's got the right idea with that pass. Mkhitaryan. Federico Chiesa. And the ball back with Inter here. Federico Di Marco. The ball with Martinez. Di Maria keeps going. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. A good effective pressure high up the pitch. Oh, lovely weighted ball. They might be in. Well, not the best clearance. Di Maria. And a decent delivery. Applying vigorous pressure. Locatelli. And the danger cleared. Well, nicely cut out. Now, what can they do with the ball? Now, attacking possibilities for the Nerazzurri. Henrik Mikitarian. Oh, keeper dealt with it. And well, they're going for the short one. Well read by Pogba after the cross was played in. Barella. Is it going to be? Well, good defending, clattered out of there. Rabio, And he did what he had to do defensively. And a good-looking ball. Well, here we can see it again, and it starts with the ball over the top, perfectly weighted. And then the finish from Di Maria demonstrates his ability to make the right run at the right time. What a good goal. So the ball is rolling again at one all. Very quick thinking there. Chiesa. And denied by the keeper. Impressive. Trying to deliver it accurately. Well, as a defender, that will sit you down to the ground. Pogba. Superb block. Can they hit on the break? Well, they seem to be onto something positive, but it faded away. Di Maria. Opportunity. Well, really fine goalkeeping. Good diving stop.
So the corner played into the box. Struggling to get it away. Well, they can bring it out now. Chalanolu. Matteo Damian. And he read it well. Vlahovic. Oh, that's an interesting pass. Rabio. Pivotal moment defensively. And there we have it. The first half comes to an end here at the San Siro. Not a typically influential performance. Well, as they get the ball rolling again, interesting to see how the second half pans out. How about the cross? Martinez. And the pressure is on. Can he clear it away? Counter-attacking very much an option. He'll try his luck here. Well, it ended up being easier for the goalkeeper in the end. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Couldn't keep it. Damian. Chance to do damage. Mkhitaryan. Takes the shot. Oh, the goalkeeper did well to hang on to that one. Di Maria. Bremer. Vlahovic. Now Paul Pogba. It could have been awkward for the goalkeeper. It's a substitution for Juventus. And played in by Di Maria. Well, he failed to get it away properly. Chiesa. Nicely saved. And the danger is averted. And the ball back with Juve now. Martinez. Martinez! And a goal to re-establish their advantage. Just look at the celebrations. take another look and you have to say the defending is so poor that's far too easy the keeper had no chance there and back playing here with Inter the team holding the advantage Paredes Quadrado Kostic has it. Locatelli. That's a good looking ball. Quadrado. Di Maria waiting. Pretty comfortable piece of defending. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Well, there you can see Inter haven't been able to control the possession. But when they have had it, they've looked so dangerous, particularly when they press high up the field, win the ball back in those areas, and then counter-attack quickly. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. Di Marco. Inter in a position of menace. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Barella. And he's through here. 
Oh, marvellous goalkeeping. Well, it's a top-class save from a top-class goalkeeper. That's absolutely brilliant. They will now make use of their substitutes bench. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Well, too close to the goalkeeper to really pose a threat. Federico Chiesa. Now Rabio. Rabio. An important interception. Martinez. Oh, really good header. Really fine goalkeeping. And deciding to go short with this one. Dzeko. Well, we really have to call that a squandered opportunity, Stuart. Well, what a waste that is. It's far too easy for the keeper. He should have made him work harder there. So approaching the final whistle and the visitors on course to lose narrowly here. Stuart, what have you made of it? Well, it's been a tight match, but they haven't done quite enough going forward in my view. It's all been a bit too predictable. A lot of passing, but not enough penetration. Oh, play. Stuart, an opportunity! And the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save. Here it is now, a substitution. And he's fired over the corner. Really good diving save. Well, they'll be looking to add to their advantage from this corner. Well, relying on the goalkeeper. Well, there's not long left now, but that just about keeps the minute. And over it comes. The clearance wasn't decisive. Well, that's the end of that for now. This might be ideal for the counter. Chances on. Well, it's the late show, and they are level again. Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive, and the finish is just as good. That's an excellent goal. And it's level again here. Both sets of fans being put through something of an emotional mangle. Five minutes of the 90 still to go, and the teams cannot be separated. Can they nudge in front late on here? And a goal! This is why we adore this game. Late drama, and now they're in front. Well, here's the replay, and it all starts with the delivery into the box, just begging someone to get on the end of it, and it ends up with a fairly simple finish. Certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that. Dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. And forward they go, chasing the game. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Well, these Inter fans still believe they can get back into this, but they're going to have to throw everything at it now. Time is running out. Mkhitaryan. And there to intervene. Moise Keane. And the referee is going to add on three minutes. Martinez. Now with Barella. And a goal! Real excitement here. The equaliser. Well, I have to 
say, this is a really good goal. Just watch his technique here. He just hits through the back of the ball with such power. There's no stopping that. Well, they've restarted the game, and it's three apiece. It is advantage, Juve. And there's the whistle. They can't be separated after 90 minutes. So away they go again. The first period of extra time. And it's legitimate to ask to what extent mental strength will come into this. Looking forward to it. Must take the lead here. Oh, he's been denied, and they remain locked together. Well, that's a good save, but really he should have scored from there. That's a big chance. And a Juventus personnel change here. The cross from Cuadrado. Well, the danger is still there. And I think the threat has been averted. Breaking at pace. Barella. Can he give them the advantage? Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. Vlahovic. The Bianconeri have given it away. Lukaku. Equal to the task. Di Maria. Vlahovic. Alexandro. The delivery. That's all they can conjure for now. Can they do something positive on the counter attack? All hands on deck. Oh, that's a pass of high quality. Really vital interception here. No worries for the keeper. Alexandro. Good looking sequence. Crossing opportunity. On the last touch off the defender. So a corner coming up. And the substitution will occur now. Corner kick played in. Half time in extra time and still they are level. Well, underway again, the second period of extra time. Who's going to prevail here? Promising looking ball. Can he get the shot off? That's great goalkeeping. Well, what a save that is. He was so alert there. In a short corner, let's see. Goalkeeper doing his job, getting the touch. They'll repeat the trick. Corner again. Elects to go short. Now, will the cross work out for them? Making sure nothing untoward happened. Di Maria. It's got to be! The keeper diving magnificently to make sure he got there. A well-taken Juventus corner could be so important given the run of this game. Who's going to get on the end of it? Not really the ideal clearance. Well, threat averted. Martinez. Inter still on the attack in the game's closing moments. A level contest. Unable to keep the ball. 
Well, the counter chance looks very real. They need to get bodies back. Is it going to be? And a goal! There he is at the double. They just can't subdue him. Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive, while the movement in the box is equal to it. It's such good timing. What a goal. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Gozens. Time and the score line against Inter, but they're not out of this. It's with Robin Gozens. Mikitarian. This could level it, but denied by the keeper. And at this late stage of the proceedings, it could be highly significant. Well, it could be a huge moment, Derek. So little time left now. Well, if only he had timed his run slightly better. Offside. And showing fine vision. Well, the decision is offside, and he's bound to be a bit disappointed. Well, he's actually made his run before his teammate had control of the ball, and that's why it's offside. And the electronic board delivers the news. Two minutes of stoppage time. And a chance to whip it in here. Can he take advantage? He can't hold on to it. Able to clear the danger, at least for now. Well, that'll be a free kick. And there it is, the full-time whistle here, and it's a victory for the visitors. Yes, Derek. Well, it could have gone either way, couldn't it? It's so competitive for much of the game, but they kept pushing, kept believing, and probably deserved the winner in the end. A great result.